me poppin', I'm a blossom I don't need a bop, mine to my robbery I'm official, on a dotty You can hit a room, room in my robbery I'm not sorry, no, I'm not sorry It's official, I'm a problem I don't need a dis- Hey Royals, welcome back to my channel As you all see my title, today's video is gonna be an unboxing and I'm so excited to show you all what we're gonna be unboxing today. This box is literally huge. I have the behind the scenes of like me figuring out how to even get it upstairs into my apartment and all that good stuff. It'll be included in a vlog or I might include it in this video, we'll see. It's an embroidery machine. And I'm so excited because you guys know that, first of all, you all have been cheering me on for months and months and months about getting into embroidery and putting me on to different YouTubers that can teach me what to do and all this good stuff. And I'm so appreciative of that. And you all know that I had just recently purchased my brother PE800. And now I was fortunate enough to be partnering with Fracoma and they went ahead and sent me their EM1010 machine. It's a 10 needle embroidery machine. I'm so excited. I'm gonna stop chatting and I'm gonna start unboxing and then we'll just kind of talk about things. Next couple of months, I'll just, you know, learn it. And luckily with Fracoma, if even though I'm partnering with them, it's the same way with any customer who would decide to purchase a machine with them. It comes with training, so I'll actually have a one-on-one -on -one training with someone who's gonna actually teach me, walk me through how to work the machine, software, all that good stuff. I'm just super excited. But anyway, I'm gonna stop chatting and we're gonna get right into it. So I'm gonna adjust you all so you can see. So this is the full machine in its entirety. Guys, this machine, um, or everything in total, weighed about 235 pounds. You know what I'm saying, thick. Okay, so I've got my scissors and we're gonna start opening. I now see that these are three different boxes. So this box right here, then this box there are embroidery, thread, and supplies. Let's open this box. So this is just a bunch of different pamphlets about threading. So next in here, there's some backing. This is easy tear away. This is the stabilizer. This is cut super hefty plus just right. Another stabilizer, but this is a thicker version of it. Got more, but these are for hats. So this right here is the actual thread itself. These are coming like with the basic colors, gold, white, silver, gray, black. And then I see we've got a blue one here. And again, there's a full catalog of all their supplies. So if you wanted to go through them yourself, and then we've got more colors in here. Comes with your more like brighter color. So we've got red, yellow, like an orange-ish yellow orange. And then we have like a brighter orange, pink. You know, you can see it. So these are some really, really pretty colors. I'm excited. Okay. That was box number one. That was like the thread. That was the thread supplies and everything like that. So I'm gonna keep, make sure I keep all my paperwork. Next up, I can see this box right here. It says that it's a table stand for the embroidery machine. So, um, figure out how I want to open this. All right. I'm literally so excited. All right. One of my favorite things is like opening a box. Anybody else? Oh, this is like a nice sturdy table. Okay, so showing me how to put everything together. This is basically like the instruction and assembly sheet. So this is the first piece. Great quality. These are one of the stand legs. Go well, a box. Oh crap. But there's a box within the box. <laughs> Another stand leg. And then we've got side railing. I believe. <laughs> now I'm gonna open this box. I'm pretty sure it's probably just like the smaller tools needed to put this together, but I'm gonna see. Okay, yeah, so these are like the wheels so that it can be pushed around, which I'm so happy about because I was nervous considering how heavy it is. And then more stuff. So of course with assembling, the machine will understand how everything works. Then we've got tools, which I appreciate them sending the tools needed to put it together. And then we've got both rooms. Box is now empty. 
able to move on to the big baby. Here they actually gave um, instructions on how to unpack packages. A Rakoma hat with embroidery. Ah, that's too cute. time to pull apart the styrofoam and this is the machine then I'm gonna just take the plastic off she's literally so beautiful Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. I can't wait. Like it's beautiful, oh my goodness. Everything about it is beautiful. And then there's like a toolkit here. So, I'm excited. So again, thank you so much to them for sending this out for me. Like I just feel so blessed, so excited. There's like, I'm trying to turn it a little bit so you guys can see. So these are the tin needles here. I'm gonna learn how everything works over time, but I'm guessing this is like where it threads through. Um, and then there's like a screen on this side. And I'm just so excited. And I'm pretty sure I already know I'm gonna have this set up in my room. So we're gonna assemble the table. So what I'm gonna do is, um, I'll be back. We're gonna assemble the table right now. This is still, let me see. It's still pretty heavy, so I'm gonna wait until I have some help to lift this onto the table, but we can at least, at least assemble the table together. Okay, so I have a problem. I feel the need to edit everything like right after I film it. Sometimes, not always, but anyway, let me show you guys my plan, okay? So, as we know, in the last apartment, pretty much like, the living room area was kind of like my office and I did not like that because like when people come in, boom, business. I don't care for that, but this time it's like gonna be in my room, which my room is gonna be, you know, it's more a personal space which I'm okay with. I'm gonna show you, close the windows real quick though. So we can see my plan. Thank you so much to my subscriber who got this desk for me. Um, I actually kind of talk more about this like in the vlog that you guys will see coming up. But so this is where my desk is right in front of the window. So when the windows open, there's like a nice view and you know, just something to look forward to <laughs> when you're sitting at home working all the time. And then a lot of natural light as well, which is good. Want this whiteboard to go up on this wall right here to just write things like to remember things like that. And then over here is where I want to hang these up. And you guys know a bunch of you have sent me so many nice letters notes business cards i want to hang a bunch of them up on here with like wooden clips as well as like when i have orders like especially urgent ones go ahead and clip them on here as well and those i'll like figure out a creative way to hang both of them here and that's just going to be the setup then this space right here is where i was figuring out i'll go ahead and assemble the table and bring the embroidery machine so that's the plan so we're going to go ahead and set you all
um but i was trying to put this together and yeah it's not working like okay so i'm gonna tell y'all what it says it says place the flat sections of the two columns on the floor parallel to one another facing inward so i did that which y'all saw then it said rest each connecting plate which is plate which is b the little pieces that y'all just probably saw me play with for five minutes uh, with the lettering upside down on the inner side of the columns maybe i'll have my dad come over one of these days or something maybe tomorrow i don't know but overall i'm super excited to get started and like i said i have training thursday so if uh, it's allowed i'll like maybe record a little snippet of it or not not even just like the actual verbal portion of it but just like you know the act of me in training so we shall see but anyways if you're new to my channel make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button give this video a huge thumbs up comment down below any questions comments concerns video suggestions and all that good stuff and i'm excited to teach you all about more the more i learn thank you so much to recome again i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video Peace. for one quick second i bet you got away without getting an emoji of the day Emoji of the day is going to be prayer hands because blessed, blessed we are. All right, see you tomorrow.